four hour stay in St George we stayed at Pelican Rest Tourist Park it's only a smallish park isn't it it is a smallish park but it's actually been quite good yeah as you enter there's a pool there I don't really want to film it too much because there's lots of people reception and just a 12 meter pool here Oh, nice, got some drive through sides. Step sides are Yes. So we might just walk around there and then this is. What do you reckon about, I don't know, 10 cabins? Cabins? There's cabins up there. Yeah, maybe 10, 8 to 10. There's some cabins. We're thinking down here at unpowered sites. Lots of trees for shade. This weekend they had some sort of car rally on um, in St George. So the caravan's been pretty full with the car rally people so they're gone early in the morning and not getting back till later so it's been pretty quiet <laughs> it it's been full but quiet oh, need to see coming back. there's a lot of swags every swag imaginable Here's one of the rally cars up there. Alright, through the middle of the park there's a camp kitchen. We found out why there's so many midges as well. It's because of the floodwaters that have been through. And they said once the water subsides and dries out, there'll be no more midges. Very right. Gas bottle supplied at this one. Yeah, and you've got a pizza oven. Where? There is down there, look. Pizza and bread only to be cooked in this oven. Could have cooked a wonderful bread for us. Some gas stoves, full fridge, and a beautiful fireplace. Imagine coming here in winter with that. That'd be perfect. Okay, then we've got the good old amenities block. Let's the go laundry. check out the laundry prices, shall we? It's always a good thing to know. That would be interesting. Yeah. What to pl you place your bets? Four five, or five dollars? Five. five bucks. Five bucks? Let's go check it out, guys. Oh, six machines. Three. Four bucks. Four bucks. Four bucks. Pretty good. Are they, um, oh no, they're not mixtures. They're clothes dryers. Oh, they're clothes dryers. Do trace. So two clothes dryers, four washing machines, yeah, five four dollars as well. and $4 a hit. That's pretty cheap. That's all right. But we've got a washing machine in the caravan, so. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. And then at the other end are the ladies and gents, showers and toilets. Very, very clean. Do you know what I've noticed with all these caravan parks out back is the toilets have all got security screens for the toilets and they ask to keep them closed to keep the bugs out. Yeah. Maybe the snakes out too. And the frogs. The wasps, everything. The wasps, everything. So there you have it, guys. That's all there is at Pelican Rest Tourist Park. There's not a lot here. There's but not a lot here at all. Caravan parks. They're it's quiet, not shady. So you can see all the trees. These ones are the drive-through sites. There's two rows of drive-through sites. So, and we are tucked just down the side here. In the shade of the Coolabar tree. Here we go. 
had no neighbours here. So it's been quite nice. Oh, last night when I came in and went early this morning. Oh, that's right. I didn't even see them. There we go. So Pelican Rest Tourist Park in St George, Queensland. Big thumbs up. Yeah, it's, it's lovely. And I think it was $40 a night, this one um, for power of water. Um, but yeah, it's very nice. Here's a look at what we can see from behind. So yeah, thumbs up. Thumbs up. Big thumbs thumbs up. up. Very happy with this caravan park. Okay, there's another caravan park review from Only Leaving Footprints. Don't forget to subscribe and give us a thumbs up. See ya. Thanks for watching.